that it's all nicely tucked in and made. Oh, whoa, 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 what are you doing there? Hold on, what are you doing? That's the way I like it. I have some garbage up here, some dog food and stuff, but other than that, it's nice and clean. Actually, your bed ain't too bad, bad either, Diesel. Got a little bit of hair on it, but I don't blame you. I don't hold it against you. You're a hairy guy. A very hairy guy, man, thanks. Hey, Sarge. Get up here. Get up here. Come say hi to the good people. Come here. Come say hi to the good people. Come on. I'm texting again today, guys. Just warning you. Honorary texting today. The other day, I was an honorary Arizonan. I need a shirt from, like, every state, I think. Every state. I just go look. I'm sure they got them online somewhere. You can get a shirt from every state, but today... Texas. What do the Texans do? Is this what Texas does? Texas! Or is that something totally different? Did I just offend somebody? Did that, was that like a, a gang symbol or something? I thought this meant Texas. Texas. No? Does that not mean Texas? Sorry. I'm a Canadian. I don't know these things. Sorry. Hey! Hey! Let's go, bud. Put her in gear. I don't know. I can't wait to pedal, man. I can't wait to pedal. Get, get your feet on him. Okay, fine. Then don't sit on my throne if you're not going to actually do any work, man. That's the working chair right there. You sit in that chair, you're expected to work. You know, I, I don't know what work is, man. I just I just eat food and fart. Yeah, you do. You had some pretty good ones last night, too. High five. Yeah. Morning. Yes. Still gathering my brain together. A little bit over there, a little bit over here, a little bit over there. Diesel, how you doing, man? You look tired still. So. Yeah, you sleep good? Are you up all night guarding the truck? Good boy, you can sleep all day now. All day. You probably slept like a rock, some guard dog you are. <laughs> okay, we've already been running around here for a while, so they're all tuckered out, that's why he, <laughs> he can't even stand it. He's all tired. Uh, let's get on the road. We got to get to Iowa. We only got three hours to get there. I think we're in Iowa already, aren't we? We're at this casino. Oh, we slept that last night. Diamond Joe Casino. <laughs> looks very nice at night. During the day, it just looks like a regular building, but at night it's all, you saw the pictures from yesterday, right? If you didn't go back and watch yesterday's vlog, link's down below in the description. Don't bite me, man. Don't bite me. That's not a good habit. That's not a good habit. Shouldn't be biting people. Only the people, only the bad people. I'm a good person. I'm the good guy. At least in this truck I am. Right! Right! Alright, here we go, here we go. Everybody buckled in, let's go. And you go. Oh, look at that trailer there, nice. Salute to you. Turn left on Diamond Joe Lane. Patriotic. I want a trailer like that too. All right, okay, I don't know what he's coming, I'm coming. Get out of my way, get out of my way. Morning time, get out of my way. There's that Diamond Casino I was telling you about, Diamond Joe Casino. Wanna throw some money away? Maybe next time. Interstate 35 South. Turn 35 left w. on Wheeler Wood Road. What? And turn left. What? Why? Yeah, there's Burger King here. Oh, I forgot about that. Ugh. Yummy. State officer. Oh, you're DOT. You're a trucker cop. Oh, for a second there, I was going to give you a salute. <laughs> I'll still give you a salute. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Driver, you're in trouble. 
You're in trouble, driver. Wonder what he did wrong. Yeah, he's getting him. He's gonna get him. I know diesel, he got him. Trucker cops. Turn right onto I-35 South. As long as he's wearing his uniform and driving his work vehicle, I try to avoid him. I don't look at him, I don't talk to him. I, I talk to him, whatever I talk to him, whatever I'm just like. As soon as they get into regular plane clothes and they're off duty, hey, hey, I'll take them out for a barbecue. Here we go, here we go, this is the one, right? Yep. Give her. All right, Diesel, buckle in, we're about to go into overdrive. me dress up again same place as last time exact same place so except I got cooler shades on this time once I get out of the truck though I actually have to put on the safety shades but these are just as safe but they're not approved <laughs> I'm not making fun of them they actually didn't tell me to use my safety glasses they were okay with me using these but I know that technically Technically, we're supposed to be wearing the approved ones. But mine, you guys all thought they were all dirty, right? No, those are scratches. <laughs> that's how bad it is. They're scratched up so bad, that's why I don't like wearing them. They're so dark. These, I just bought these. I sort of like these better. I've never had orange lenses like that before. So last time we were here, we were talking about safety and how important it is. Safety is no joke. But this beard is a joke. Look at this. I need to shave this, man. It's like, I need to trim that out, eh? Oh boy. And it grows this way, you see that? Hmm. Why does it grow that way? So annoying. Grow straight. Oh well. We're here and we're gonna get unloaded safely. No doubt about it. I better not hurt myself. They might get mad at me. And then I'll have to wear even more safety equipment next time. Maybe I'll have to wear a hockey helmet with a face mask next time if I hurt myself. Especially with this beard. What do you guys think? Hanging out? Enjoying your time? You can't get out of the truck here though guys, I'm sorry. They won't let you out of the truck here. They gave me specific instructions. You have to stay in the vehicle at all times. I'm sorry man. I'll go for a run after. Wish that would be the case for me. I wish they'd look at me and be like, you sir are not allowed to do anything. You have to stay in your truck. How about you have a nap and we'll do all the work for you. Hey, there's an idea right there. No, I have to uh, open the doors. I have to slide my axles on my trailer. Remember the other day we were talking about sliding axles? Uh, here they like you or they demand you to slide your axles on your trailer right to the back of the trailer. That's just that it's a little more stable when they're going in there. Personally, I think it's a little uselessly pointless. But hey, I'm just a driver. I don't know anything, right? So once I slide the axles to the back, I gotta open the trailer doors and then back into the dock, let them unload. And then I gotta clean out my trailer afterwards yet so it's ready for the next load. It looks like I'm headed up a little further north from here uh, towards Waterloo. And I'm going to be picking up a trailer that's going to be loaded there. So I might be losing this trailer that I have, which is, it, I'm kind of sad about it. Remember I was showing you those little halo tail lights? I like those. This is one of the new trailers that we have. It's like brand spanking new. And I've been able to pull it around with me for the last two weeks. 
and now I'm gonna lose it. I might get an old one. Oh well. Well guys, you wanna play some games or something? I'm gonna play some computer games. You guys down? And take over the world with me? We're playing the, I'm still playing that game Civilization, right? Uh, where you conquer the world, pretty much. So, yeah, I don't know if you guys knew this, but I'm a pretty big deal in the world. I have conquered all of North America, except for Alaska. There's another guy who's holding on to Alaska, and he's not very nice about it. I've also claimed all of the eastern coast of South America, so all of Chile, and, you know, the eastern coast all the way up there. Mexico is mine. Uh, I've claimed United Kingdom. No, 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 I've claimed Scotland and Ireland. But England belongs to another player, and he won't give it back to me. He got there first. He settled a city there. Like, no! I'm supposed to have England. But I do have all of Australia. Except for the bottom little part where Melbourne is, I think. Something like that. You guys don't really care. I'm taking over the world. The digital world. It's called uh, Sid Meier's Civilization. That's the game I've been playing. There goes Patrick. So I was just doing my paperwork and whatnot, getting ready to go. We're headed up to the Waterloo area for the night, and uh, how do you know? Patrick came by and said hi to me. So special shout out to you, Patrick. Thanks for stopping by and saying hi. He was just driving past Ross Park. He was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Games said hi, it's not me in the flesh. So he watches the videos every day. He actually must be pretty diligent on it because he knew everything that happened in today's vlog that went up today. So you're on the ball, Patrick. Impressive. So it's always nice meeting you guys in the per in person, in the flesh, in the person, in the flesh person. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Come and say hi if you see me. But if the curtains are drawn, nobody's home. Just saying. <laughs> what was it, like a week ago or something? I was sitting at a rest area and I was sleeping. Uh, I usually drive really late, so I sleep late, right? And other people stop early, start early. And uh, it was probably about 9 in the morning and someone came banging on my door. They wanted to say hi to me, but I was sleeping. But it wasn't really their fault because I didn't put the curtains around the, the windows, so they didn't know I was sleeping. So now when I go to sleep, <laughs> close the curtains and nobody's home. <laughs> I'm off in the wonderful land of dreams. I love it there. It's my favorite place. Cedar Rapids, you can see the water tower right there. So I'm not lying to you. This is Iowa. Nice and green in the summertime. I like Iowa. The second time I've been in Iowa this month, when I'm not just passing through, where I'm actually picking up and delivering. I gotta get an excuse me. 1.4 kilometers. Take exit 252C on right to I 380 North. Thank you very much. Everybody, let me on the highway. Cedar Rapids, didn't they make a video, or a, not a video, a movie about Cedar Rapids? Had that guy from The Hangover in there. I think it was called Cedar Rapids. He's like an insurance agent or something. I remember that. It's funny. So now, we head about an hour up the road to Waterloo. Live 380 North. Waterloo. Waterloo. There's a Waterloo, Ontario, too. Did you know that? But we're going to Waterloo, Iowa. We're going to stay at the truck stop there and wait for directions tomorrow. There's supposed to be a trailer ready for me there in the morning. And that's going to take me to Winnipeg.
here to Waterloo, Iowa. Or is it Evansdale, Iowa? Same thing. Got a pretty good spot, actually. Look at this. Straight out the driveway. No one's going to park in front of me. In the morning, I can just go zoop, straight out. Perfect. Also, by parking in a spot like this, I minimize the chance of me getting backed into if my two neighbors decide to leave it and I get a new neighbor because the people just drive straight forward and back straight up. There is no like angled backing up, right? They're pretty bad at backing up if they hit me on a straight angle like this. Right? They, they can pull right into the driveway and back straight up. That's what I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So anyways, this is where we're going to end our day because my day is ending here. So I've got to edit up yesterday's and today's so I've got some extra time. That'll work well for me. Thanks for joining today, guys. Joining every day. Thanks for all your feedback in the comments. Guys, if you guys are looking for a Trucker Josh shirt, don't forget down below in the description, there's a merch store. You can get your own Trucker Josh shirt. I'm coming out with new designs soon. Uh, I've got the new, uh, I've got royalties to a few new logos that I'm going to be putting onto new shirts and stuff. And I'm really looking forward to releasing them. But I like the old ones as well. I'll just say like Trucker Josh right here or something. Uh... Other than that, there's links to past vlogs of mine down below in the description. We're coming down to VidCon in less than two weeks. We're really excited about that. Vlogger Fair is in August, so there's two events this summer that we'll be at. If you guys are going to be at either one of them, let me know so that we can maybe arrange a meetup. If there's going to be enough of you guys out there who know me, maybe I'll schedule a meetup down in the Anaheim area there while I'm down there so that we can all uh, go out and eat or something. Go and get ribs at Montana's or I don't know show me the sights or something I'm gonna go to the beach at least one or two days I'm gonna go roam around Hollywood and act like I live there for a while and I'll have my motorbike with me and I'm talking about Anaheim uh, for VidCon in the next couple of weeks I'm really looking forward to it we'll see what happens it should be good uh, there's a lot of my youtuber friends that are gonna be there I'm excited to see them again if you guys are watching let me know if you're coming, if you want to hang out, I'll be around. I'm staying right close to the convention center. And actually, I'm really close to Disneyland as well. I sort of want to go check out Disneyland. <laughs> Let's see what finances say when we get there, but <laughs> I might have to at least make an appearance. I gotta go see Mickey Mouse. Actually, I really want to see Goofy. He's my favorite. Who's your favorite Disney character? Let me know down below in the description and stay tuned for the slideshow. I'll see you tomorrow.